Game Stars TV post game on Sunday night with Rob Wilkinson. Uh, a thoroughly professional performance against a possibly weakened opponent, but thoroughly professional from the start, from start to finish, and a four point weekend. Yeah, exceptional. Exceptional, to be honest. Um, I, I, I fancied us to win, but I didn't fancy us to win like that, as, as comfortable as it was. So, yeah, it's a great weekend. And like we said last night, that we played. We played fairly well last night actually but then the, the idea is looking ahead the next weekend was to be better again tonight which yeah. we were probably a little bit better than I thought we were going to be to be honest yeah and we, we, we obviously we've said we are cliche we're taking it looking at the game coming up but we do have an eye on next weekend which is Solihull and Whitley so to put the performances in this weekend 19 goals scored Everybody kind of clicking, all lines contributing. You must be really happy going into the next. Yeah, I mean that, that's that's as good a preparation as it gets. I think as far as this weekend goes, um, we, we, we're starting to we're starting to find our feet. Like as in, we're starting to move the puck around a lot more. Some of them goals we've scored this weekend, uh, especially probably on on the first line with Roly, Mikey, and and Sykes. Some of some of them goals this weekend were just exceptional. And, and it was also, I think. It was also nice, I think, for them to put a bit of a show on for the fans tonight to see some, to see some really, really nice hockey. Yeah, um, and it wasn't, it wasn't that we were running up the score, but it's just we needed to keep going. We couldn't switch off because of next weekend. Yeah, I mean, t to be fair, we did change things slightly. We put Rowley back in D in the last, the last period just to give Lucas Dowd a little bit more ice time, who who chipped in with a really nice goal, which was nice to see. And um, so we kind of, we maybe did take our foot off a little bit in that respect but then we, we, we uh, so, yeah but it was still it, 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 it was still great it was enjoyable and yeah and you talk about the put on a show for the fans two home games in a weekend isn't isn't easy for the fans but two good crowds bigger tonight than the usual Sunday night which is which is great and that can only be good and say getting the momentum now for the home games for next Saturday in particular yeah, for, hopefully like, like I said we, we just um, I, 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 I've gone on record as saying I don't think I, I think we've probably only been operating about 60-70% this year I, I think that probably has gone up a little bit tonight because I mean we, we've in my time with this team that's probably as comfortable a win as, as we've had I think so yeah it's, it's very satisfying you talked about Lucas obviously chipping in it was kind of pinging in off the post, it was a great finish. But again, that, that second line and third line, getting Callum back, obviously easing him in gently, but getting him game ice, which is important, looking at the, at the run to come. Oh, definitely. I think getting Callum back is, especially with them, um, especially with Mossy being injured, I think getting Callum back is, is really important. And it, was, and it was important for him to get a lot of ice time with a view to the games next weekend, because I think we probably need Callum probably more defensively to make us defensively a bit more solid so yeah just and, and, it, and it's probably quite hard because he's more or less coming in what over a third of the way through the season and everybody else has got sort of 10 12 13 games under the belt so he's starting fresh which is which is quite tough so it was it was really important to get him some some ice time tonight and following on from what we said last night another 30 35 minutes for Mark Turnbull in net which can only do his confidence and to say the, the benefit for the team and get him some meaningful ice as well. Oh, definitely, to be honest, Mark looked, um, Mark looked really, really comfortable. He looked really, really comfortable. He looked uh, very professional, very... He, he, he was on his toes and, yeah, it, it was... But, but we need that because you never know... You never know what's going to happen down the road. So we need to be prepared that if he's called upon, that he's ready to go. Yeah. And like you say, so we, we talked about the, the weekend coming up. Solly Hull on Saturday, it's Whitley Bay on Sunday. So we've got two important training sessions coming up this week. Too important. It, it needs to be, um, especially after two games. After two games this week, a Wednesday night will come in, and we'll try and work hard on Wednesday night. Get get the floor moving. Get the get the feet moving fast because we have to be a um, we have to be a high tempo team. So that that was like one of the things tonight. We were trying to we were trying to restrict the shift length to sort of 30, 40 seconds and just keep the lines flowing and when we do that when we do that I think we're really really effective so yeah so Wednesday night will come and we'll try and we'll try and keep that tip up on Wednesday night and then Thursday night we'll probably try to work on a few more things um, just to, to improve the team again.